you want the progress to continue, put your hand in the air. Put your flags in the air. Put your lighter in the air. And tell Dr. Mitchell we're ready. Yeah, we're ready. Senator Pamela Moses, in addressing those gathered on the carnage on Sunday, says the youth stand ready to vote back the new National Party into office. She added that the groundwork has been done with the successes of the Imani programs and others. Hence, the Prime Minister should announce the date. At present, in the last four years, we have trained 3,500 youths. We promise you that we will take them back and it was done. We promise you that we will train them so well that they can work anywhere in the Caribbean. At present, we have 2,000 of them doing CVQs. When they get their certificate, they could go to any Caribbean island and get work. Prime Minister Dr. Keith Mitchell, in response, says he too is looking forward to the election period, but not before the entire team is made public. Sister Pamela, Keep asking me tonight over and over. Tell the Prime Minister we're ready. Well, we will name the last five caretakers not long, long from now, maybe another month, maximum six weeks. And when we do that, sisters and brothers, we have our teams going around the country, checking to see if everyone checked the voters list, know all who is on the list, make sure you do your canvassing, and they're reporting to me and the leadership of the, of the NNP. And you know, a bunch of people in the NNP are, based, are serious scientists, so we're going to look at all the numbers carefully and when they say they are ready and we see the numbers as they are then I will say sisters and brothers we come into one of the biggest rally we have ever seen in this country sisters and brothers I can't even tell you where we're going to hold that rally with the date in his back pocket the Prime Minister is adding to the call by the electoral office for people to get registered and participate in what is now being considered as one of the most critical elections in Grenada's history, hinged on the success of the homegrown program and just how Grenada moves forward. Joseph McKeesmith, GBN News.